Hello, Cancer, my darlings, and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a great day today. So let's see what's going on around you in love, what spirit wants you to know. Just take what resonates, leave the rest behind. Ooh, this is this is an end to a situation. The end. Yeah, you, you didn't even make it through chapter one. I feel like... Um, you were dealing with somebody who was really, they were there and gone. They were, they were in and out energy. It really didn't last that long. Um, yeah, I feel like this is the end to High Priestess of Water. You could be a water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. I feel like you're about to get a message here from somebody. Hold up a minute. Something is over here, but now I'm feeling like somebody is looking. I feel like maybe there's a karmic situation that has ended as well. You've been very misunderstood um, in this whole thing, this right here. I feel like this karmic blames you, but honestly, I feel like you guys were played and ghosted and the blame was put on you. That's the feeling that I'm getting here. The blame was put on you. I feel like you've cried a million tears here. You were hurt. You were heartbroken. You were played, betrayed, ghosted, and somebody put the blame on you. And now this karmic thinks, I feel like uh, either they're blaming you or this whoever played you did. I feel like whoever played you blamed you, okay? Whoever played you blamed you, and that's what's got this karmic all upset. They think you're the blame maybe for, um, I feel like their situation is coming to an end as well, and they're blaming you for it. They've blamed you this whole time. Yep. I I've been picking up on that in the readings too. You were the one who was hurt. You were thrown to the wolves. You t you had They gave you the blame for it. You were the scapegoat. I mean, everything's been done to you. Heart broke, dragged through the mud, had your reputation dragged through the mud. And you know what? You, I feel like all you wanted to do is love the, whoever this was. Love this person. That's it. You gave them love and then you took the blame for being heartbroken. That's ridiculous, man. Yeah. High Priestess. I feel like people are listening to your story, though, now. I'm getting the sense that you're out in the public eye. Um, you could be a, a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Uh, you could be um, maybe a, a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius here. You're about to get a message from someone. Clarify this message. Maybe it's you that needs, maybe you're the divine is saying you may need to listen to the message, but I feel like people are listening to you now, okay? Maybe they're starting to realize that you aren't the blame for this. Somebody toyed with you. You were ultimate wish fulfillment here, and I feel like somebody just used you as a little toy. It's this person here. This warrior, I feel like this is the masculine energy who was messing with you and who blamed you for all of the pain. Everything that they put you through, you took the blame as well. They may feel trapped with somebody here, a possible fire sign. I feel like you're taking a leap of faith. You're getting out of the situation here. You're, you're leaving this behind. Something, this is a situation that's coming to an end. I feel like the divine is leading you in a whole new direction here. Because they don't want you played with anymore. Okay? Yeah. I feel like you're, um, you get to have a wish granted is what I'm feeling like. At the end of this cycle, after everything that you put through, the divine is blessing you. So make a wish collective. Because you're about to have a wish granted here. Um, I feel like it could have something to do with your abundance. You could be an earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. I feel like you're in this Empress in the Minor Arcana kind of energy. Extremely abundant. Um, 
you're about to possibly even um, be wealthy here, okay? You're going to be having a major blessing because of all that you've endured, the strength that you've shown, um, perseverance, right? No matter what people threw at you, you got through it. It couldn't keep you down. I feel like you've had nothing but integrity through this too. You know, you 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 allowed people to make their own choices and they dragged you through the mud. Readings like this just really tick me off, you guys. <laughs> and of course, you know, I am not feeling well. So that that only that only adds to the frustration, right? You could totally be an earth sign or a possibly Leo. But your person is feeling very trapped and stuck where they are with this karmic, okay? Who's doing nothing but sending you bad energy. Blaming you for everything. Looking at you like, you know, they want to, they want you out of the picture, man. Okay, so we've got all the signs already out here. Water, air, earth, fire. So you could be any sign. But this masculine, I feel like they've been playing stupid. They blamed you, and I feel like they've been trying to stick with that story. And um, you know what? Uh -uh. I feel like people are starting to see the true, um, the truth about all of this. And you have really, you've really been put through a lot. You've endured so much. Look at you. You're the rose, okay? I feel like this masculine is in awe of your beauty. They see it, you know. I feel like they've been watching you somehow. So you could be in the public eye here, in the spotlight. I kind of get the sense that this masculine is haunted by what they've done. Okay, and now it's almost like they're, they're feeling fearful to speak the truth because they're dealing with um, a crazy karmic who's just feeling very deceitful and revengeful, like she wants revenge. Um, moon here, you could be dealing with a cancer or you could be a cancer. Yeah, I feel like... I feel like somebody's being haunted by by knowing, you know, it's just the guilt is eating them up inside, okay? I feel like they could even have some kind of spirit or um, maybe it's your spiritual team or your ancestors coming in to whoop their butt because, you know, honestly, uh, they know what they did to you and they know it, it was so wrong what they did. It was so wrong. You know, they hurt you and then blamed you for it. It's it's ridiculous, yeah. And you were nothing but loyal to this person. You were loyal. And I feel like they they um, alienated you. They ghosted you. They, I mean... They threw you to the wolves. They hurt you. They shattered you. They threw you to the wolves, they blamed you, and then they watched those wolves tear you apart. And this person, the guilt is eating them up alive, okay? I'm telling you, it's eating them up alive. You were loyal to this contract. I feel like this was um, some kind of soul contract. It says success here too, so I feel like... The divine is holding you in high regard right now. You're about to get a big blessing, a lot of success because of all that you've been put through. And this person over here, they're stuck with this um, karmic that just wants revenge and they're being haunted. I'm telling you, they're being haunted. Yeah, you have been... Um, You've been 100% real through this whole entire thing. 
You've stood in your boundaries. You've stood in your truth. You've spoken your truth. You've handled this with grace and integrity. Um, and I feel like, you know what, I, you've, your um, uniqueness has remained intact. Uh, your loyalty has remained intact. Yeah, you're getting a major victory here. Feeling very confident now, moving forward. Very connected and tapped into the divine. Very intuitive. Highly intuitive. And man, you were gentle. You were so gentle with this person coming out as um, the high priestess of water. You were gentle, loving, kind, nurturing, caring, giving. I feel like now you're a warrior. You've got focus. Um, you're focusing on your north node. So all of your abundance, whatever it is that you're growing, um, you're just focused on yourself and your future here. But you have emerged a warrior through everything that this person put you through. It's not just this person. The, the second they put the blame on you, the whole dang community got involved. Everybody jumped in on that, right? Right? I feel like you've gotten spiritual attacks um, from a lot of people in the community, maybe even people you don't even know. People that you do know that you gave love to. I don't know what's worse. So, I mean, yeah, you're emerging um, a warrior here. You've been really dragged through the mud. And it's this person's fault. They're getting haunted. Yeah, the divine won't let them forget. Don't forget. Look, I mean, I'm telling you, this person has spirits in their house right now. Um, I feel like it's um, your ancestors or your spirit guides. They're coming in to fight this battle for you. And they are not letting this person forget what they've done. I feel like everything is about to be exposed. I feel like it's already in the process of being exposed. Um, and, uh, yeah, I, I, I look at him. He even looks white as a sheet, doesn't he? I feel like... They're, yeah, they're being haunted. So they could be experiencing some, like, um, paranormal stuff in their house right now. They could be seeing shadow figures being touched, um, things m being moved in their home. They could hear voices, um, having lots of nightmares. This person has to sleep with the lights on. I feel like this is the this is the universe telling them they need to be obedient here. They need to do the right thing. They need to tell the truth. They need to bring justice to the situation and to this high priestess. Yep. They need, to, they need to bring some kind of fairness to this because what was done to you was beyond unfair. It was um, appalling, okay? I feel like you're letting the situation go. You're accepting what you've been through and you're forgiving and releasing this so you can move forward, okay? Cycles, this cycle has ended. Once again, this moon card keeps showing up on the bottom of the deck. Um, you could be a cancer here. This could be the energy that we're going through right now here with this cycle. Um, we're coming out of the new moon energy. We're in a retrograde and we're going to be going into the full moon energy. That's on May 5th. So something could even go down around May 5th. Hold on, I'm, I'm rubbing my eyes. I'm so sorry, you guys. Oh, these allergies are terrible. So I feel like something is transforming here. Um, the universe is stepping in. This person's being haunted. Constant reminders of you. They're seeing signs, synchronicities. 
um, they're seeing your name and ads and movies and um, getting messages through music. It's everywhere they go. And at night, this person's having nightmares. At home, they're being haunted. The divine is not leaving them alone about this. I feel like the universe, the divine, they're angry, okay? Yeah, their, their life is a whole lot of complicated right now because of what they've put you through. It was appalling and disgusting and shameful. And the universe is demanding justice. Demanding justice for this high priestess. So get ready. I feel like between now and May 5th, something's about to go down. Yeah, they made you feel um, isolated, alienated, um, maybe invisible to the point where, like, um, you know, maybe you were saying, I'm innocent in this, and nobody would listen. By then, their little lie had spread like wildfire. Fire. Everybody in the community jumped in. Um, jumped on the bandwagon to bash you, basically, is what happened. So everyone involved in this should be ashamed. And I'm telling you, the divine is ticked off, angry enough to send in ancestors to haunt them, and they're demanding justice for, the high, for this high priestess. All right, what else can you show me? Give me one more card for the collective. And notice, you know, notice this masculine is out here looking like they're playing dumb. They haven't said a word through this whole entire reading. They don't, they don't want to fess up and the, the divine is not leaving them alone. Yeah, look, I feel like you gave them nothing but love here. Nothing but love. And you knew your worth. You knew your value. You, you focused on yourself and your abundance and your stability. You left these people alone. You didn't talk about them. You didn't bash them. You didn't do anything to these people. Nothing. And I feel like it was a whole community who hopped on a bandwagon to bash you. Because of this masculine's lie. I'm telling you now, like I said, the universe is demanding justice from this person for what they did to this high priestess. Demanding justice or they're going to destroy, they're already starting to destroy things in this person's life. I feel like they're already going through a lot of chaos with an angry karmic. They're already feeling guilty. They're being haunted by what they did to you, okay? I feel like the guilt is eating them alive. Um, things are going wrong in their life. I mean, the divine is coming in to destroy stuff. They demand justice. I'm hearing unleash the kraken. <laughs> yeah. Yep. They demand justice for what was done to a beautiful person who just wanted to love them, who was innocently put in a horrible situation, blamed for it, and then was dragged through the mud by a whole community. You have got to be kidding me, right? Oh my gosh. Oh, this person, they're going to go down. Um, let's see what else we can get out here. What, what else can you show me here for the collective? Once again, you guys, I apologize. I'm so sorry. I don't feel good today. You've got blossoming abundance coming for you here. Yeah, there's that community. The whole community is bashing you. Telling you. They're talking about you behind your back, trashing your name. But you know what? You're over here in the garden gate. None of these people can get back in. The biggest thing I notice about this picture is the gate. It's closed. They can't get back into your inner circle. 
uh, that may be one of the things that they're um, trash talking you for, okay? Telling you a whole community is about to go down, um, especially this masculine because of this lie. And they, they allowed other people to believe it. See, I feel like you have been, this person had you in a trap. They had you in a, not only a mental mind trap, but I feel like they had you stuck to the point where there were so many people bashing you in, the, in this community that you may not have even wanted to leave your house. And now I'm talking about this person put you through this and you were innocent in this. All for giving this person love. You know, now you're standing here realizing that um, you're, you need to choose a new path. You don't want to feel all tied up anymore. You made it through this cycle. Why should you stand here and, and wait, feeling, it, feeling stuck and trapped in your mind, right? I feel like you guys are moving forward. You're moving on, and I feel like you're protected by Archangel Michael out here. I'm telling you, Spirit is protecting you, and they're going in to um, leave a path of destruction behind. Yeah, you're about to get new love here, too, Collective. Yep, you're walking away from this. You're walking away, and, and I'm telling you as, soon as you, as soon as you walk away, justice comes in. Justice. And they tear things up, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, they're going to they're gonna completely demolish some stuff here. Demanding justice, yeah, door to spirit. I feel like the divine is opening this door and oh, and allowing yeah I feel like you're you're finding the door to healing and personal happiness you're going through this door and and the divine opens up another one and unleashes um they unleash the kraken on these people I don't know what else to say it feels like a haunting it really does. It feels like spirit is coming through the door and going to haunt these people. Okay? Oh, it's it's going down for these people. It is going down because they were messing with an earth angel. I'm telling you. They were messing with the they were they messed with the wrong one. And you endured that. You did. Oh, they messed with the wrong person, man. Yeah, collective. Um, the uh, All I can say is they're being haunted. Your ancestors or some spirits are being sent in to haunt these people. And the universe, they're demanding justice. If they don't get justice for this earth angel, um... The divine is going to destroy everything in in their path here. Seriously. I don't know what else to say. And it all started with this person here. And their lie. Their lie to use you as a scapegoat. Wow. 